Hello, it's Jason Payne for Cold Banker, Dan Hop Realtors. Well, I'm back at the master plan community of Esperanza, just an eight minute drive from downtown Bernie, because the house behind me that's built by Coventry is almost complete, and I wanna show it off to my clients. Let's go check it out. This is a wonderful cul-de-sac section of Esperanza, and wait till you see the backyard. Um, that's really gonna sell this lot. This, like I said, is a cul-de-sac, slopes down. You got some amazing views right out the front of your house. And these are like the last two houses in this cul-de-sac. Once they're completed, you're gonna have no construction around you. Just talk to the neighbor next door. Seems like a really great guy. So yeah, this is gonna be an awesome house for somebody. Well, my clients is, give you a little sneak peek. My client's gonna go ahead and close on this house and then put it back on the market. So. If you are looking for somebody that's wanting to move to Esperanza but doesn't want to wait, check this house out. All right, let's head on inside. Now, I don't know what the what our asking price is going to be yet, but hopefully they finish this up and they close uh, by the end of July 2022. And so, yeah, if you're out there on the internet wanting to move the area, this is going to be a great deal for somebody. So let's talk about the house. We do have two bedrooms right up front. And off the top of my head, I don't know the total square footage of this or which plan it is, but I will put that in the description box. And I will put a printout of the floor plan on the last slide of this video. So you got a decent closet, nothing special about the closet there. You have a shared full bath. Definitely like the tile work done on there. Yeah, my clients uh, decided it took this house has definitely taken a while to complete. So in the meantime, they went and bought something else and have decided, hey, uh, we can go ahead and sell this one. But because of how long it's taken, they're they're not they're being pretty clever with it with uh, going and selling it and they're gonna make a nice little profit based on what the cost of houses are right now. So you do have, this is now coming in from the garage, your laundry room with uh, nicely done cabinets. Speaking of the garage, does have a two car garage with dual water heaters. So it's hard to see, but yeah, there you go. There's two of them. And plum for water softener. Now, while I'm out here doing these videos, I also did an amenities tour video with my lovely assistant and daughter, Miss Amy. So definitely check that. I'm gonna put that in a link up above in this video. Another bedroom toward the front of the house. Now this is gonna have a much bigger closet. And right outside the door, the access to this bathroom you see here. Real similar to the other one. Okay, there is a flex space. Perfect if you want to turn this into your office because they've already got a electrical cork put in. Some nice windows. Ethernet cable on the wall there. And yep, yeah, with everybody working from home nowadays, it's nice to be able to just close the French doors up and boom, you're at work. All right, on to the main living space. Also, has, this is gonna be your breakfast nook slash dining room space. Tall ceilings in here. I love the little knockout to give you that extra chair space along there. This is the main space. They went with the dark, dark brown, it's almost black looking, like it might be. Uh, yeah, I think it's almost black there. Um, maybe it is black. But you got the built-in for the refrigerator. And this is a little bit extra wide. No, maybe that's standard sink. Sorry, I got, I've had a busy day, so sometimes my clients blur together. But you do have your built-in oven and microwave combo. Your standard corner pantry. 
do like the uh, like a three-dimensional type subway tile there so there is it's not just flat boring this is a gas community so uh, it is gonna be gas and you gotta love a good single basic granite seal sink a few from uh, behind the sink You got the fireplace with a plugs for your TV, Ethernet ports, uh, cable jack, uh, gas fireplace. And now before we go check out the master bedroom, I definitely want to show off this yard because that is going to be the key selling point of this house. I get lots of people relocating here and they're wanting this lot, this type of lot. Flat. Well fairly flat but big and privacy no one's gonna be right behind you wrought iron fence this lot is perfect for putting a really nice pool right in this section you can even put a fire pit section back there you got a nice lovely live oak tree on the property and you're surrounded by like oak trees all around you and just I love love the size of this lot if you did have this lot, I would recommend having a riding lawnmower and maybe having a shed somewhere built back here so you can just park your riding lawnmower because this is going to be a little bit of work if you're trying to do a push mower. You see off in the distance the nice view because you are up pretty high. And this is the side yard, so you're definitely not going to be right on top of your neighbors. So... <clears throat> And yeah, you got all this other space. You can still do even more stuff with it. All the activities. But uh, yeah, definitely a nice outdoor patio area. This light can be, it is blocked for a fan. So if you want to put an outdoor rated fan, you sure can. And it's got the uh, plug outlet there. So if you wanted to put some lights going around the top, making this even more entertainment friendly. And it's pre-plumbed for gas on the outside. So if you want to build your outdoor kitchen, you sure can. All right. Opening up this door and boom, you're right into the master bedroom. Once again, tall ceilings. Plenty of space in this master bedroom. Lots of good lighting. And then here is the bathroom. It's going to have two master bedroom closets, two vanities. Like I said, they're still working on it. So here is one of the closets. With a nice shoe rack. You've got your soaking tub, real deep soaking tub. Might want to put some blinds up there. Or just go to the gym a lot. Yes, I know I've said that joke in a lot of my videos, but I still think it's funny. All right, the big shower mud. Uh, I wouldn't say it's a mud inset shower, but because uh, you're not stepping down, you step over this little ledge here. What a nice, good size shower here. And they'll put the glass in as well. And then here's the other closet, which is also a good size, especially for just one person. And it has its own shoe rack as well. Plenty of racks if you have long dresses. And your all the spots for where all your ethernet cables and stuff will all run into here. So you can put your modem in there and router and all that good stuff. Show off the floor. Sorry, right, it's a little gritty with me walking with my boots on there. So yeah, this really nice house. Uh, my client's just waiting to close on it and then we'll put it on the market. We haven't discussed exactly what price we want to do with it. Uh, I'm gonna wait until we get closer to actually having a closing date and then kind of do a market analysis to find out what a fair price for this house is gonna be prior to us listing it. And yes, I do help a lot of buyers, but I also can help sell houses too, so this house will be one of my listings right after we close on it. 
All right, that's gonna wrap up tour of this Coventry home house in Esperanza. Love the community. Check out the amenity tour that me and my daughter did that I'm gonna be putting up on the internet as well. And I've also done a motorcycle tour of this community too. Love, love, love a lot about this area, including a wonderful school district, Bernie ISD, it's one of the best school districts around. Anyways, uh, if you're interested in this house, reach out to me. I will put a, uh, my contact information can be on the last slide, but in the description box is gonna be linked to my calendar app. So if you wanna schedule a Zoom meeting with me, you can do that or a phone call. But uh, hope you liked this video. If you did, hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, and of course, keep sharing these videos with your friends and family. All right, take care now. Bye.